Hey, Stimscopes teachers, AJ here. I wanted to share some advice on uh, how to plan if you're using Schoology to uh, push out digital assignments from Stimscopes Math or Stimscopes Science to your students. The easiest way to navigate our curriculum resource is going to be through the teacher site. So as a teacher, you really want to log into Stimscopes on the teacher portal, and it's much easier to explore the different elements, and these are the things that you would be assigning through Schoology. Um, so to help you with planning, let's start with math, and then I'll switch over and show you what we would recommend for science. Um, on the math side, when you're in a scope, uh, you want to, the first place I would direct you to would be the home section inside the scope. You can see we're looking at fifth grade multiplying decimals here. So if I go to the home tab on math, there's something called the scope overview. And if you click on that, and then you can download a copy of it over here, this is what it looks like when you print it out. Um, this is going to list by name all of the different elements in the scope. So you can print this out and then start highlighting and marking the ones that you would want to assign through Schoology. And then when you log into Schoology, you already have a cheat sheet ready to go with um, the exact things that you want to uh, create assignments for. So that's what I would recommend for math. That's going to be the scope overview, and it's specific to each scope, so you can download a custom document for whatever scope you want to assign stuff from. Um, switching over to the science side, uh, it's a little bit different. So now I'm in a second grade Texas science scope here on physical changes, and here, same deal, you're going to that first tab inside the scope, and this time you're going to look for something called the scope summary. And uh, this one's not a downloadable document, but you can very easily just click the print button on your teacher toolbar here and print this thing out. And what this is, is same, same idea as math, it's just in a list form. It's listing for you all of the different elements in the curriculum. And then you can kind of explore what they look like up here across this bar, get a feel for it. Um, so you've printed out your scope summary, you've looked at the different resources and you've kind of marked the ones you want to put into Schoology. So when you log into Schoology, you just log in and pull up the content you want by name and it's much easier uh, than trying to navigate that way. So I hope that helps um, plan a little bit better um, more streamlined for you with Stimscopes Math and Stimscopes Science in Schoology. Let us know if you have any questions or maybe some other ideas that you come up with on better ways to plan. Thanks for watching.